Yes, what's going on, people? Joining me are two legends right now. One producer legend, one singing legend. Introduce yourselves. Thanks, mate. Um, this, is, <laughs> this, is, this is JK. And I'm Shola Amma. Why do you say thanks, mate, like that? It's like, <laughs> just a nice compliment. comment. Yeah. Hey, like well, it, you, like know, you know, I've got to say it. It's not going to be like, I'm here by just, oh, yeah, whatever. You'd be surprised. That, <laughs> <laughs> well, good thing I'm not saying yeah, levels in that true, way. True, true, true. So your brand new single is out now. Yeah. Both of you. It's called Danger. So how does it feel to get it out for the people? Yeah, it feels really good, to be honest. It's been a while Relief. in the making. Relief. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we've been waiting. Because <laughs> we've done it, we cut it sort of last year. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Okay, so yeah. It, we, we've, we've been sitting on it for a bit. And yeah. It's, the timing feels good. Do you mm. know what I mean? Well, you got the end of us at a summer track, but you kind of released it like in the end of summer mm-hmm. into when it's getting a bit cold. Mm-hmm. And obviously mm-hmm. people are still skanking in the clubs. Trying to brighten up everyone's fall, you know what I mean? People yeah. have been asking for extended mixes already. Oh, there you go. So there That's you go. Good. People Perfect. want that extended skank. <laughs> in the club so yeah yeah man danger skank so how did you yeah. two kind of like come together and then make the track in the first place then um, it was um, a session I, I was in a writing session doing a track um, and then there was another session going on and there was two songs involved one M- M&E K and Amy wrote on yeah and the other one I was writing with someone called Caroline Alien and um, I basically got back in the studio after a couple of weeks later and was listening back and loved them both yeah so just took a chorus and a verse from each of them made the song and then it turned out to sound like danger but the vocal needed to have that R&B garage yeah amazing vocalist over. yeah which is where show to come in yo first 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 name that come to a mind yeah you know that's, I mean? it's cute I like that so what made you of me. what made you jump on the track then yeah because cause I don't I, I say this a lot but I don't really just take songs that are written by other people normally now yeah. because I like to write I like to be involved in what I'm doing in some have it come from me but when I heard that straight away I was like yes Sign me up, let's go. When's we get in the studio? Yeah, which was, was a relief. Yeah, it was. It, well, was, good, it, yeah. it made perfect <laughs> sense. As soon as I heard it, I was like, of course, I get it, let's go. Yeah, because obviously last year you released something which was more like reggae kind of vibe. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I feel, I feel like, wait. like, we haven't heard from you since 2013. I'm like, really? It was, um, Thank you. Surreal, Thank surreal, you. surreal EP? So surreal. There yeah, you yeah. go. There you go. That's so more like it. At least, um, yeah, I did my research. <laughs> Thank That's you. That's the key. That's the key part there. Because <laughs> yeah. what people were saying, like, oh, it's been like three years or something. Yeah. yeah I mean, yeah. it's been a minute. I haven't really put out stuff like, properly for a while but I've been making music the whole time so. where was well I remember like gigs which was like 09 yeah, yeah we toddler, did toddler tea. toddler tea stuff yeah um, and then the toddler tea sound stuff yeah was it J2K's on the door yeah yeah, 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 yeah that's yeah. right and then the stuff with Curtis since Junior the reggae project yeah, yeah. But the thing is, so yeah, obviously going making that crossover from one to the other is different yeah, though, yeah. I'm a genre hopper though like mm. I literally like I would you know, I've done stuff on the R and G stuff with Terra Danger. Yeah. Obviously, the garage, the R and B, and then the reggae stuff as well, like Lovers Rock or whatever you want to call it. I, I don't really. I just do the music that feels good. I don't really think you should be confined to a genre. I think when you're an artist, you can mess around with different sounds, and if it works, it works. Yeah. Mm. That's that's always been my kind of philosophy on it. Some people are like, "What do you do?" But I feel like I'm essentially R and B artist. Yeah. But I just sing the music that I love. So. That's a good answer. Yeah. Solid. What about for you when you do producing? Like, do you kind of approach it the same way, or? Yeah, well, um, yeah I, I mean, I have done, but more more recently, I've been trying to stick in a lane, if you like, just yeah. to keep doing it and getting better at just the one thing. Mm-hmm. I think it's kind of different on both. Like, when you're doing the music side, yeah. beats and stuff, mm. just trying to keep some sort of thread. Yeah, thrill. consistency. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. that is the main thing as well. You want to make sure the music's good, and mm-hmm. if it's kind of like here all over the place, and it's a mm-hmm. bit like. So what if you're doing it for other people? It doesn't matter then. Yeah. Yeah. If you're trying to do your own for yourself, thing, yeah. Because you know I mean? yeah. this is like your first kind of like big kind of release by yourself. Like my, for my, you, for myself. You. Yeah, 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 yeah. Before it was all about everyone else. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And sending songs out and getting them cut with different artists and whatever. But now it's, it's much more exciting because mm. the whole idea of playing your own song out with it's DJ your baby. and yeah, yeah, man. And yeah. you see see the reactions yourself rather yeah. than yeah. someone ringing you up saying, oh, well, I like it or I don't like it." Yeah, or they might not even know that you made it because most yeah. of the time when you make a track, yeah, when you're producing it, people forget about it. Yeah, yeah. forget about you, and then they're like, "Oh, that person's good on the track," and then mm. yeah. yeah, so it's slightly different. Yeah, it is. It's massively different, especially doing stuff like this as well. Like I'm normally in a studio and that's it. There's yeah. no like promo. You know what? You're good because usually most producers will not come out. You know, really, <laughs> most producers <laughs> will hide away. You'll hear like, yeah, yeah producer singing a single car, a solo car. Yeah. yeah, but yeah, JK, you would be here, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't quite Get like that it. Working, it gets man. Me out. It's good as, yeah. long as, as long as people know their research and they know the questions. That's key. There that's you it. go. Exactly. I like it. So, danger obviously is the name of the track. Mm-hmm. What's the most dangerous thing you two have done? Oh wow, I've done a lot of dangerous things. I don't want to mention hardly any of them. 
to be uh, honest. Too dangerous. Too dangerous to be radio. Give us like a PG one. Then, like, <laughs> PG. Like, nothing too I deep. I don't, think she, I don't think Charlotte can actually. <laughs> well, you just, you just can't do 100 all the time, yeah? <laughs> I'm not even saying anything. <laughs> saying we, anything. Need, we need something. You can't just leave it there. You can't um, make a track called Danger and leave us like that. What's the most dangerous thing I've done? I'm going to say I jumped out of a plane. Okay, I'm going to say I was right behind you. I was right behind you. Me and Charlotte jumped out of a plane. Yeah. Are you just both using it, yeah? <laughs> is, that just, is that what it's going to be, yeah? <laughs> I'll just leave it there. That's deep, you know. You know what? Let's get into the track, then. <laughs> you two can introduce the track, then, as you're not going to give me anything dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Shella Amma. And I'm JK, and this is the new single called Danger. Danger. That was Danger, Westside Radio, it's your boy Mars in the building, and joining me is JK and Shola Amar. Now, the video. Can I at least get something on the video? What's the plan for that? It's, a, it's, it's happening. It's happening. Yeah. It's just got to be confirmed exactly what it's going to be, but okay. it's going to be very soon. Yeah. Within the next week or two. Well, I think creatively there's still some yeah, stuff to, happening. You're still yeah. looking at like, treatments and stuff? Yeah, I think we've got a treatment that we're really happy with, it's just... Get into the yeah. Get into the the confirmation finishing line, bang, and let's do it. Okay. So it won't be long though. Yeah. Good, good. good yeah, and you'll love it. Well, you'll love it, love it, yeah. yeah It'll be fun. Know. I like doing videos; they're fun. I hope so. Cause... I'm gonna have a little cameo though, just like a little. Well, you're just doing Yo. a little cameo. Yeah. I thought I think you'd be so. in it kind of like quite a bit, or you're doing we'll more see, of that we'll vibe where like other people. We'll know. see. You'll have to wait and see. I'm just trying, you know. Yeah, so it's my job to try see. and you know, tune in and see. <laughs> get some stuff out there. <laughs> but obviously, garage is kind of having a little bit of a revival at the moment. Mm-hmm. Like a lot of people are kind of making yeah. garage tracks. So for you guys, what do you think is the best garage track of all time? Ooh. Ooh, of all time. All time. Yeah, yeah. I hate that all time thing. Oh, it's like so hard many. to pick. You can take away the all time video. I would have to say one of my favourites is Gabriel. Mm-hmm. And is it Roy Davis Jr.? Yeah. I just love that song. Like, always have, always will. And then obviously, all the MJ Cole stuff, all the Wookiee stuff. Yeah, I would say and like. Monster Wolf. Boy as well, I like. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. I even like deeper stuff like Wookiee, Down on Me. Yeah. Love, like, and and um, Little Man. The yeah, Wookiee remix of Sia. Yeah, it's a classic. Man. It's a whole bunch. It's so much. Yeah. Melody, yeah. that was a tune, Master Steps. All yeah. That. You think it will come back properly? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's a, it's a great question. Yeah. I mean, I want to keep chucking him. I want to keep chucking that two step, but. Yeah. It's hard, isn't it? It just, 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 just depends, doesn't it? It depends on. I yeah. think it could do. I just think it's all about the song. Yeah. yeah. You I can agree. take the beat away from the song and it still stand up on I the agree. guitar. Yeah. Then I it's agree. got a chance. Is that what you tried to do with this one as well? Yeah. Is it going to be like an acoustic version? Or I think we probably should do an acoustic version. We should version, do one, just, just for acoustic's sake. I, yeah. kind of, I, I, just told, I just told you not to do that, didn't I? So. Yeah, so you're going to be like, I told yeah, you yeah, not tag to on do the that. I just need that little, you know, <laughs> Executive producer CC credit. in there yeah. as well, you know what I mean? So what do you think of the current state of UK music today? Obviously it's thriving, it's, it's kind of its biggest point right now. I know you're still connected with like a load of like rappers from the grime scene and all that yeah. as well. So what do you think? Family. Yeah. I love it. I love, I love seeing how they've all evolved you know obviously gigs I, start, I worked with a long time ago like yeah. maybe sort of 10 years ago I first worked with gigs mm. and um, just seeing his whole growth and his evolution and the fact that he just did his his last project and he's like I'm doing me I don't care what anyone says yeah. and then he's got like a top five album and he's just yeah. stuck to his guns I love that and all a lot of the MCs I've watched kind of grow and take over the scene and grow up and become men and doing that in their own lanes. I think it's a really beautiful thing. Yeah, mm. I think it's mm. it's good to see that as well. <laughs> and obviously with you, you're kind of coming back with a couple of tracks as well. Right I now. am, I am. So you've got Angel, the Angel track. Yes. Then you've got the Coco track. Yes. And it's the Lindy Linden, J. that's it. I was, yeah. was going to say Lipton, so... <laughs> Lipton better, you know, iced tea, you know, innit? Then ones, yeah. So yeah. Are, we, are we expecting a little, like, one-two takeover from you next year? We'll see. We'll see this. I mean, I, I, I've worked on a whole bunch of features throughout the last year. Yeah. And then, um, obviously, they all kind of came out at the same time. Yeah. So everything's sort of floating around at the moment. But the main focus, obviously, is this track with Jay, because this is the first thing... Um, we done this a while ago. Yeah. Like, so this was two, 2015. We called it Danger, yeah. right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Last summer. Um, so yeah, da- Danger's the main thing. The other, the other stuff's sort of like just little taster tracks, and then I'm working on my solo stuff. Okay. So yeah. What about you? What's the plan for next year? As well? I'm asking this so early. No, no, no. Like, it's all good, man. I've, I mean, I've, I've been working for like past couple of years. I work with like really good artists. Like um, I've got a wicked tune with like Becky Hill. Yeah. Got a couple of. Uh, 
Kaleem Taylor. Okay. You know from the Promises record? Yeah. Um, Arrow Benjamin. So I've got, got some few, really strong yeah. songs. So oh. it just, it's just depends the timing and what's, what fits. Do you know yeah. what I mean? All right, you know what? I'm going to do one thing for you, right, you two right now. How well do you know each other? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Right, so I'm just going to get you, get you guys to choose one question for yourself, right? Okay. And then ask the other one. I'm just going to be here to see how well you know each other. Okay. Are you choose buddies from a year ago or are you just... Yeah, oh, we yeah. kind of only met really about yeah. the record. I think yeah. we'd seen each other out and about before, Yeah, definitely. Though. Yeah, yeah, We've yeah, only, yeah, like, yeah. really just, just met properly doing danger all right so i i do know though john goes away a lot and is always glowing and tanned <laughs> so that's an easy cop out that. though if you travel <laughs> a lot then you're always going to come back like that <laughs> and he's a sick producer you you much. have just failed this time <laughs> all right let me know. let me try and do this properly because you're making me feel embarrassed now right i can do this so i'm going to ask so i'm asking who am i asking the question to not me I'm, no I'm, I'm asking him a question yeah, you're asking Jacob. about about, about yourself. what though? about me about yourself yeah oh okay how many tattoos do i have <laughs> <laughs> it's a good, you, you got a guess in it six. Oh wow terrible guess how many? 22. No, 24. Wow. No, you didn't even know the answer to that one, yeah. 24, 24. yeah. 24? Yeah. So you learn something new every single day? Yeah. JK, what's yours? Um, What's my star sign? I know this. Basically just I like, know this, I know this, I know this. Do you? I know this because I, I asked you straight I know, away when we met and now I've forgotten. You might have to just take a random guess. Taurus? No. Oh, Capricorn. Damn. Oh, Capricorn. I knew it was an earth sign, see, I was yeah. close. It's the same element. Mm. Yeah, Capricorn. that was all right. Like, it was both a fail. You guys get to, uh, <laughs> what's my star sign? What's my star sign? You don't know. Aries. No, we're only, we're only supposed to be one each. You know? <laughs> I know, sorry. <laughs> exactly. You can't just get hurt now because the horoscope's there. So you, you open up the game. So. That's true. Well, what, what do you think I am? What star sign do you think I am? Um, I would say Sagittarius, but possibly a Libra. Gemini. No? Mm-hmm. Uh, all oh. that. Pisces. Are you Pisces? I'm yeah. Pisces. When's your, what, what day is your March birthday? March 8th. 10th. Okay, so you're true Pisces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you're true Pisces. Pisces gang. <laughs> Re- are you Pisces too? Yeah, I we love got, that. We got the same birthday. Um, me, Riri. Who else is a sick? Kurt Cobain was a Pisces as well. All the best ones. Yeah, shout out to Pisces gang. Yeah, I feel left out now. <laughs> hey, so the next question might not help as well, you know, because we're about to talk about a show like Abiobi. Okay, uh, we were talking about, about, that. about that earlier. Actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, what? Like, obviously, he plays for like what Fleetwood Town now. So I he's... have no idea who he plays for now. Yeah, but he's he's, he's, he's gone down. Yeah, that's where Vardy come from, right? Yeah, yeah, but wow. obviously it's the other way around now. Yes. Like, Vardy's gone up and Show yeah, Abiobi's yeah, gone yeah. down. Wow. So why, why do people keep like? The thing is, I think I can kind of tell why people at you. Right? Yeah, because he doesn't Ami, have a Twitter. Is that? But it's Amiobi. And Amor. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's, they, yeah. they don't care about how but it goes. But as well, a lot of them do it. A lot of them play around with me. Like for a long time, they've been doing this for a couple of years. Yeah, when yeah. he was at Newcastle, they were doing it. And I think a couple of people did it by mistake. Yeah. And they saw me actually like entertaining it. it. Yeah. And then so everyone just kind of went at it. And I think I, I like it. I don't mind the fact they're so passionate. Like the football fans tweet me probably more than music fans do. You know, they're really, really passionate about it. And sometimes a lot of fun. But um, yeah, yesterday someone tweeted me a picture of him and Shola Miyobi and said yeah, yeah. thanks for the pick and then Twitter just went off it just went off <laughs> I think someone already wrote an article about it saying that yeah. you, know, you need to have a word with him and that yeah. no because I, I tweeted that as a joke Some me and him me and Amiobi yeah, yeah. need to have a word because I feel like it'd be really cool if we, we actually met up yeah. that, would, that, would be, that would be funny yeah we should and get him in the video or something bit. you need to do that you know what I mean just uh, yeah. banging out Newcastle, like young Newcastle talk from back in the day yeah. and you know because his career kind of spanned you and your music career was going yeah. on as well yeah it's kind of like yeah. you know what I mean it's not like he's a new like footballer coming up yeah. you know at the same time if they've tweeted you more then you need to make a football tune Link up, yeah, football team for the next World Cup. Yeah, because yeah. Euros is gone. You know, yeah. make one. That's true. You two link up, do bits. <laughs> Maybe get a couple of rappers on it. We'll be laughing. Yeah. That's my idea. Just yeah. say it. Yeah, exactly. You've got a lot of it's your typical Pisces, super creative. Creative, trust me. Yeah, man. All right. So one last last question. Yeah. So, is there going to be any tours or dates from you two coming up, or there will be one hundred percent to yeah. to be confirmed? Yes, TBC. You let me down today. Just, but this is down. the whole thing. Got to watch the space. Keep an eye on our twitters and socials and all of that, and then you can see what's coming. And where can they? Where well. can they find you? Um, so my my handle on Snapchat, Twitter, everything is at Shola Amar. One yeah, word. Uh, yeah. Mine's at official JKAY. There you go. The guys who won't give me that much of my information about anything. <laughs> but they got a brand new track out, so you make sure you go and check it out. It's called Danger. Show Lama and JK. JK on production as well. Very big track. 
if you still are looking to skank in the summer, or it's in the summer anymore, winter, then make sure you get the track right now. It's out right now, so make sure you go download it. It's on iTunes and all that, yeah? Yep. Yep, Spotify, Spotify iTunes, the whole, whole deal. Everything, any platform. Thank you guys for chatting to me today, by the Thank way. Thank you. Peace.